Thanks for staying with us on On Point. A team of psychologists and education officials have gathered at the Ndamayase Senior Primary School in Meleni in the Eastern Cape. This comes after a horrific accident claimed the lives of six pupils. The truck collided with a stationary bucky with scores of school children on board. Sixteen pupils were rushed to the Nelson Mandela Academic Hospital. SABC News reporter Nkurule Konyembezi and video journalist Vincent Debele are coming to us from the school in Meleni. We are coming live from Damasa Senior Secondary School. You will remember that uh, yesterday there was a horrific accident that claimed uh, almost uh, uh, in fact, uh, six uh, lives of the learners that were schooling in this school. Uh, and uh, we are told that uh, uh, scores of them were taken to Nelson Mandela Academic Hospital. And we are also told that uh, at least uh, two of them are still in the hospital, while well, one is, is in a critical condition. But now we are also uh, here to witness a, a, a group or a team of uh, psych psychologists and uh, council of churches who are here uh, just behind me who are giving uh, counsel, counsel to those learners uh, that have been affected by this uh, horrific uh, accident. But now I'm joined by the principal of the school, uh, Mr. Zuma. Mr. Zuma, this must be very shocking for you as a principal, as also as a, as a parent, if I put that way. Yes, sir. It is very much shocking. Uh, as a school, we are grieving. It's sad. The mood in the school is very bad. Yes, indeed. That what, is the mood. What actually happened? Because a uh, lot of stories that are coming up. Yes, uh, I was here at school around uh, 10 past 3 when the school was uh, just uh, ended. Uh, then I heard a loud bang while I was here at school. Uh, I reckoned, no, this is weird. Something must have happened. Few minutes after, I was called by one of my staff members uh, to say one uh, or two of our students are involved in a car accident. And then when I arrived in the scene, I was told that uh, a truck which was coming from the direction of Umtata to Nalemi lost its, co its control due to the failure of the brakes. So it collided and crashed with the buggy which is used as the scholar transport from Damasa Senior Secondary School. So also when the school is out, these learners used to uh, sit on the rails. There's a bridge on your way to Amtata. So they sit on the rails there, chat and uh, hitchhike some uh, learners. So it collided with the buggy and included the learners who were sitting on the rails. Uh, they are saying the truck flew from the road and it landed uh, next to the bridge. So apparently uh, it knocked 15 learners, but uh, six of them unfortunately died on the scene, but nine of them were taken to Amtata General Hospital. So how did the, what call, uh, the family members receive the message? Because uh, they must be very shocked. Yes, they, indeed, they are very much shocked. As a school, we tried to identify the deceased learners. Then we asked from the other learners as to, in fact, we went to SA Sams and contracted the numbers of the, uh, the, the parents. Then we called the parents to inform them to come to the school. Then when they came to the school, we did not really disclose the, the, the news. We called some uh, pastors and some priests around. Then we prayed. After we prayed, we then went to tell them that uh, the learners are no more. That was uh, Mr. Zuma, who is the principal of the school. Of course, uh, the counselling is underway, and uh, the council of churches, uh, parents, and uh, unions, uh, Satu and uh, Naptosa, they are all here to make sure that at least uh, they calm down uh, the nerves of these uh, learners here who have just lost their colleagues, their uh, fellow students or fellow learners uh, in this uh, horrific uh, accident. Back to you at the studio.